Hello everyone, my name is Melan Jacob and this is IRS Group. Welcome back. OIT writing is a concern or a question and I am going to address it. OIT writing is a word count. How many words are OIT count? How many words are OIT count? So this is a big question. Now generally the rule is that you have to write 180 to 200 words. But that is just a guide. Now I'll explain what I mean. Adi namuk nokkanda the. If word count a the area lana verenan, like address, lengle date, salutation, nado kaveru mo. So on the screen, you're now seeing a sample letter. Now I'm just marking that area. Which is included in the word count. So basically, a body paragraph, main content, matra ana count in So you don't have to worry about, uh, you know, what is above or below that. Other count dil varanella, number one. So that's a big relief, I guess. But number two, um, you know, should you count individual words? You don't have to. In the practice, what you can do is, one average or a line letter of word and one calculation roughly how many lines will fit in that word count and then you can count but mostly what's important is that OET does not count words OET count in other pieces of information alright so OET assessors are not going to count your letter and say like okay this letter is only 175 words it underlined the analytical where or a letter at the this is you know 220 words it over length on a I'm gonna Allah assess chain other whereas the assessors look whether you have included what is relevant and you have not included what is irrelevant so now you have a case note extract on the screen. So there is a lot of information. Uh, okay, let's look at something um, from 18th December. Responding positively to antibiotics. Now our piece of information important or no? Alleo. So if you look carefully, this is a letter to a rehabilitation um, manager. Um, yes, to the rehab services manager. So, or a patient in a discharge chamber, uh, it's a discharge letter. And there is hospital matra nada noru antibiotic therapy the details. You know, is it relevant to the rehab? Actually, it's not. So what could happen is that if you include that. In your letter, you are going to bring in an additional sentence which is not required. Rehab manager ne nengalal confused hi yana. Adu gonde samboy kinnada it's going to affect your conciseness and clarity marks. For you criteria ne affecte na the word count to godi the gonde alla. Marichche unnecessary information include the chey the pola. Definitely the word count could go up, but that is not the problem. The problem is that it's not clear, it's confusing now. So concise and brief and brevity ne ad affect it on the brief and other long guy boy. It's not clear, it's confusing. Confusion, clarity ne affect it. Instead of clarity, what you give is confusion to the reader. So that is what the problem could be. So remember additional information which is irrelevant to the particular case to that particular reader might affect conciseness and clarity. And if you don't include something that is really relevant, uh, for example, so the next line says, husband says, notice tablets for pain finishing faster than usual. Um, now, that is something which is really relevant because patient in the drug abuse history on the end of the year observation relevant. So, that unnoticed there and then the husband noticed it 
and that is a relevant piece of information. So, if you do not include it, you will lose marks in content. Relevant title reader na vendadum, a patient in a continued care na important title information include him in content and a criteria and score in place team. So, the second line is something that you should include in your letter and you score for content. So, generally, OET to your case notes, set of case notes, roughly 180 to 200 word limit to all your letter and all the information and all that. There is more information, but you do not need to include that in your letter. Relevant ITOLA content include Imperium, irrelevant ITOLA information exclude Chaydum, brevity, brief ITOLA, clear ITOLA, communicate Imperium. Your letter will be in that range, but you do not have to worry about the number of words exactly, whether it is slightly under length or slightly over length, that is absolutely fine as long as you have the right information that the reader requires. So, stop worrying about the word count, OIT does not look at that. It is a general guide, general rule on a word count. Good luck with your OIT preparation and if you would like to have expert training, please enroll with IRS group for our online or regular classes. Thank you very much.